Uh, all right, here's a good question from Jeff, who very thoughtfully included a picture of him and his dog for this important business question. Uh, all right, hey, it seems like I make it easy for people to tell me no on job interviews. M okay. <laughs> So number one, make sure the dog doesn't go with you on job interviews. I don't know what's happening, but let me just assume that you're doing that part right and you're dressed and you, your teeth are brushed and your hair is combed, there's no dog, you're upright, and you're going for a job that you're qualified for. Those are the assumptions I'm making about what you're doing. So, um, so again, the question is, seems like I make it easy for people to tell me no on job interviews. Any advice? Well, fundamentally, you should never be giving them the opportunity to say yes or no. Uh, that's a choice you make, right? So when you go to get on a job interview, they have questions for you, you have answers, but make sure that you have questions for them. And at some point you say, hey, look, I'm still trying to learn about the company. Yeah, I see a lot of stuff of Microsoft on the website. I understand that you guys do amazing things. But your particular division, matter of fact, if you said to me right now, Jeff, you have the job. Here's the employment agreement. I would give it back to you and have to say no. I don't know enough about you guys at this point. In order for me to offer you my services and say, yeah, we could work together, I need to know more about you. And then, you know, I'll go home and I'll go through my decision-making process about you. So they should never have the opportunity to say yes or no. You control that. You tell them if they're going to be able to work with you. You don't wait for them to say yes or no on your behalf. Don't take the dog to the job interview and get control of it in this way. Busyness kills neediness, right? And that will, uh, uh, and when you're not needy, then that will break loose a client from being stalled. The other thing is you can take some risk, right? And be more aggressive in terms of pushing that client 